Oh, now there's exciting. Ah. It's a hat you just don't understand. Fashion. <laughs> I'm ready for the party. Make the most exotic sandwich. You have ten minutes to plan your exotic sandwich. Then ten minutes to construct it. Your time starts now. Right. What do you think exotic means? That to me says maybe fillings that have never been seen in a sandwich before. Um. Okay. So what I would like, please, is some Moroccan flatbread. Turkish delight. That's very exotic. Get me some wholemeal bread and maybe some pita bread as well. Wholemeal, though. I'm not an idiot. So I need a kumquat, Greg's sausage roll, kiwi fruit. Let's go all sweet. Mm. Heck, everyone's going to go savoury, aren't they? Some smoked trout. Then a crunchy bar. Then a Kit Kat. Then a double decker. Oh, a yam. Tequila. Some tequila. What about you in France? Uh, croissants. OK, I'll go shopping. OK. Shall I come with you? No, thank you. Do you need money? No. OK. Bag for life. See you later. <laughs> I want to start with Mel. She mm -hmm. looked very excited, and I'm keen to see her sandwich. OK, she did say before she started, I want to blow the Taskmaster's tiny mind. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> this is so good. All right. Chocolate spread. Good layer of the chocolate orange. A little bread ski. Double deckers. A bit more of a Nutella. Let's go for the crunchy. Three minutes. Three minutes? Wow! Let's do some M&M's. Maltese. I can see why people get stressed out on these cookery shows. This is absolutely appallingly stressful. Just bronzing up the marshmallows. That, to me, is like a, a sort of Japanese pagoda. Can I give you this as well, Mel? Yes. Um, to say thank you. Is that for me? Yes. Thank you. Eat your exotic sandwich, fastest wins. Final one, please, now. What's the task, Samuel? Time starts now. OK. Oh, gang. <laughs> I can't do any more than that. Stop, stop. <laughs> Those showbiz nights, eh? <laughs> Slotted M&Ms. Only blue ones. Only blue ones. <laughs> Is it exotic, that sandwich? It's sort of... I mean, it's instant diabetes, isn't it? <laughs> well, I suppose so. It was uh, Turkish Delight, Crunchy Kit Kat, Double Decker Twix, Snickers, M&M's, Icing Sugar, Marshmallows, Chocolate Eggs, Chocolate Oranges, Nutella and a Blowtorch. I suppose it's sort of... <laughs> it's sort of exotic. <laughs> so you're going to judge the most exotic and I'll tell you... It's meant to be who can eat their sandwich the fastest. I can reveal nobody finished their sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> so it's, it's who ate the most of their sandwich. You ate four good-sized bites, uh, essentially one Double Decker, and you inhaled the M&M. <laughs> It's got to be a bonus, a nasal m and it? Always. <laughs> OK, I'm pressing pause with one of my massive thumbs. Come back to us soon <laughs> to see celebrities eating things. <laughs>
welcome back to the final of Taskmaster. What was going down, Alex? Well, bits of sandwich were going down, Greg. They've been making exotic sandwiches with exotic ingredients. Wow. But we've recently found out from Mel there was a dramatic second part to the task. OK. Here are Hugh, Joe and Lolly, the savoury sandwich makers. It's sandwich time. Meet him first. A bit of the lambuna sauce. <laughs> Salmon. I mean, ideally, the yam would have been cooked. <laughs> yeah, lovely. Just banana and kiwi. You don't need much tequila. See a bit of that sausage roll there. Oh. That's a smoked trout. Well done, I've got this for you Thank as well. Thank you so much. Thank you. <laughs> fucking prick. No! What, what does it say, Lolly? <laughs> it says, eat your exotic sandwich. <laughs> <laughs> Fast as when as your toe starts now. Oh, uh... Beautiful. Well, wow. there we go. Oh, it's delicious. <laughs> I think I'm done, though. Yeah? Yeah. Stop the clock. Mm, that's how we read it. Oh, you finished it? Mm, that's how you finish it. <laughs> All gone. Do you think the Taskmaster thinks you've eaten a sandwich? I'm not sure if he's ever had a mother's delight, so <laughs> he, if he wants to argue that that's not finished, then that's up to him, isn't it? Joe, your sandwich that, amongst other ingredients, uh, had an arctic roll and some trout... <laughs> Why was that called a Mother's Delight? Cos Alex asked me what it was called and I, in a panic, said Mother's Delight. <laughs> How were the corners of your Mother's Delight? Fucking horrible. Yep. <laughs> Lolly, mainly prawns and frankfurters, mm. yep. mainly. <laughs> I actually quite liked mine. Yeah, you so. ate for six minutes. <laughs> <laughs> and then Hugh. <laughs> Hugh, interesting. Well, I have divided it into two different sides of the sandwich. Yes. Right. So the first half of the sandwich was, I believe... I can tell you if you sashimi, want. Sashimi, halloumi, yes. Yes. wasabi peas... Parma ham Parma and ham. Moroccan flatbread. It was delicious. It just and sounds like something I'd buy at Marks and Spencer's. What, the <laughs> what fucking Marks and Spencer's do you go to? <laughs> you okay. can't get anything yeah. like that in Marks I'm and fine. Spencer's. I'm not used to someone raising their voices like that. <laughs> <laughs> My instinct is to jump on him like a puma. <laughs> in huge favour, he did eat pretty much... I mean, he tucked some away, threw some away, but he ate more than anyone else. Of course it... he did, cos yes. it was just a normal sandwich. <laughs> One person left. This is Noel Fielding's exotic sandwich. Well, I thought about an exotic sandwich, and then I thought about how I could put a spin on that, so I thought maybe an exotic dance sandwich. So I'll have to attach <laughs> some bread to you <laughs> and get you to do a tiny exotic dance. <laughs> sort of head. <laughs> is that going to work? Let go? <laughs> ah, sort of. This is going to be a powerful sandwich. It's more like a bread collage, really, when you think about it. You look exotic, I would say. I'm just going to get into position, look through my bready peephole, get ready to get turned on. Cue music.
you so much. This is for you. Oh, this is amazing. <laughs> Eat your exotic sandwich. <laughs> it's not that kind of show. <laughs> How are we going to do this? You know, your time stops now. OK. <laughs> the nib or the sandwich. <laughs> I'll have to eat the whole thing, do I? Another bit from the other side. You've had a lot of the bread and not much of the filling. <laughs> How am I going to do this? I don't know. It's your idea. <laughs> I mean, beard sandwich. <laughs> Stop the clock. That's OK. Your beard's unbelievable. Mm -hmm. Cheers like passion fruit. Not ginger, <laughs> lavender and pot noodles mixed together. Those are all good. <laughs> nice. Thank you. Well, that was exotic, wasn't it? Mm. <laughs> I think I've literally never been further out of my comfort zone. <laughs> The idea that he was made to do an erotic dance. <laughs> I, say, I say erotic. I once walked... I accidentally walked in on my nan in the bath once. <laughs> and that's the least erotic thing I've ever seen. <laughs> Yet you old horrible beat. <laughs> You're giving Noel a bonus point for eating hair. I mean, you are aware that when we're at home, Alex is only allowed to move around like a snake. <laughs> It is full of mouse droppers. <laughs> <laughs> OK, here we go. Least In exotic, least exotic. Least exotic. Yeah, huh? He popped to m and and he bought himself a sandwich. <laughs> Hugh Dennis. <laughs> Mel, I loved your sandwich, but it's only exotic if you're five years of age. <laughs> uh, Lolly, okay. absolutely horrific. Okay. Uh, so third it's... place. Second place, Joe. <laughs> Combining trout and ice cream, very brave, but not as exotic as Mr. Noel Fielding, okay. who takes the exotic foot. For more Taskmaster, subscribe now.